Hi, and welcome to a uh, tutorial about using Google Slides, new feature that allows you to record um, your Google Slideshows, almost like a, you'd see a, a YouTube tutorial like this. So hopefully it saves time. I'm usually using iMovie and QuickTime and having to edit it down and squish things together, which takes a lot more time than it, than it looks like. One minute video might take half an hour to an hour to make. So hopefully we can crunch that here. So here's the, the feature. Um, what we do, um, here's a slideshow I'm just gonna try with, with a photography class of mine. We'll experiment with this one. So I go up here and click record. And if it's the first time you're doing it, it'll ask you to unlock your camera and your microphone. It'll show you where to do that. So record new video, and here it goes. Uh, now you can see my face appears down in the corner here, and this is what's being recorded for um, my students, for example. So if I click record and the countdown goes and now I'm recording my video. As I'm showing my video, let's say I'm talking about the rule of thirds here, uh, my face down here in the corner is in a nice spot, but maybe I'll go to the next slide and I'm talking about this with my students. We can um, make that larger, looks quite nice there. I purposely set some of these slides up to do this. Um, and I can talk about the rule of thirds with my students and maybe I go to the next slide and oh, now suddenly I'm in the wrong spot. I can switch uh, the face camera around left, right, top, bottom. Let's just go up there for now. And we can talk about the information here. If you don't like the large image, you can go back to a smaller image and very small image if you want. It's up there. Um, and so you can kind of move your face around. I, I like that. That's nice because some of the slides you over line on the text sometimes as you're there. So kind of fits a little bit easier and saves you some editing time later if you're making a video uh, to talk about some of these things. You can also look at the speaker notes in the background. Um, I believe I'm 90% sure these won't show up on the video itself, but it's a bit of a cheat sheet for yourself if you need things to talk about. Uh, like my here's my lesson plan on the rule of thirds I might want to share. So anyway, you can have your speaker notes on or off with that click and it's quite basic. You can turn your microphone on, uh, you can turn the video on or off as well here. And when you're done, if you click stop, it'll ask you if you want to save to drive, which I can click here and you get some options popping up. It's going to upload to drive. That might take a little bit of time. And from there, you can probably put it on. Uh, you can download it or transfer it over to YouTube and do all those kind of nice things. All right. Hope this helped you. Bye.